Hello and welcome to quiz class. Today we have a 50 question quiz on general knowledge and we will be looking at four different categories. At the end, you can tell us how you ranked. Here we have our quiz class awards. And our four categories are ancient civilizations, famous quotes, tech and gadgets, and myths busted. So let's begin with ancient civilizations. Who made the significant archaeological find of the Dead Sea Scrolls? A famous archaeologist, a shepherd boy, or a historian? A shepherd boy. Who is credited with inventing the first schools? The ancient Greeks, the ancient Egyptians, or the ancient Sumerians? The ancient Sumerians. Who invented the wheel? The ancient Romans, the ancient Egyptians, or the people of ancient Mesopotamia? The people of ancient Mesopotamia. How many clay tablet books were part of the library of King Ashurbanipal, 1,800, 30,000, or 300,000? Three hundred thousand. What does the name Isaac mean? Wisdom seeker, laughter loving, or strong warrior? Laughter loving. Who invented the game of checkers? The Egyptians? the Sumerians, or the people of Ur? The people of Ur. What did the ancient Sumerians keep as pets? Cats, dogs, or fish? Fish. What did the ancients use to treat toothaches? Tea tree, coconut oil, and charcoal, beeswax, ground barley mixed with honey and cedar oil, or fluoride and regular dental visits? Beeswax, ground barley mixed with honey and cedar oil. Which pyramid was almost destroyed in the 1980s? The Great Ziggurat of Ur, the Great Pyramid of the Rising Sun, or the Great Pyramid of Giza? And the answer is the Great Ziggurat of Ur. Where was Hammurabi's coat of law carved? Wooden clay tablets? On a huge solid piece of black stone? Or on papyrus scrolls? on a huge solid piece of black stone. And let's move to famous quotes. Who said, it is hard to fail, but it is worse never to have tried to succeed? Thomas Edison, Queen Elizabeth II, or Theodore Roosevelt? Theodore Roosevelt. Who said, I have not failed, I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work? Theodore Roosevelt, Frederick Nietzsche, or Thomas Edison? Thomas Edison. Who said, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams? Michelle Obama, Jennifer Aniston, or Eleanor Roosevelt?
Eleanor Roosevelt. Which world leader said grief is the price we pay for love? Picture A, B, or C. And that is picture A, Queen Elizabeth II. Who said, I challenge you to make your life a masterpiece. I challenge you to join the ranks of these people who live what they teach, who walk their talk. Martin Luther King Jr., George Washington, or Anthony Robbins? Anthony Robbins. Who said the greater damage for most of us is not that our aim is too high and we miss it, but that it is too low and we reach it? Michelangelo, Leonardo da Vinci, or Jane Alexander? Michelangelo. Who said, do not go where the path may lead, go instead where there is no path and leave a trail? Nietzsche, Ralph Waldo Emerson, or Theodore Roosevelt? Ralph Waldo Emerson. Who said success is not final, failure is not fatal, it is the courage to continue that counts? John F. Kennedy, Margaret Thatcher, or Winston Churchill? Winston Churchill. Who said the greatest glory in living lies not in never falling, but in rising every time we fall? Nelson Mandela, Ralph Waldo Emerson, or Walt Disney? Nelson Mandela. Who said, tell me and I forget, teach me and I remember, involve me and I learn? Confucius, Abraham Lincoln, or Benjamin Franklin? Benjamin Franklin. And let's go to tech and gadgets. What was the name of the first smartphone? IBM Simon Personal Communicator, Blackberry 850, or Nokia One? IBM Simon Personal Communicator. What was the U.S. Constitution written on? Parchment, linen, or hemp paper? Parchment. What does the word sushi mean? Raw fish, sour rice, or fermented fish. Sour rice. One petabyte PB is equal to how many terabytes? 500, 1024, or 2000? One thousand twenty-four. What does Alexa do with your dialogue history? Stores it in the cloud to improve the Alexa experience, deletes it immediately, or shares it with third-party companies to personalize shopping? Stores it in the cloud to improve the Alexa experience. On average, people read how much slower on the screen compared to paper? 0.6%, 10%, or 25%? 10%. Who made the first computer mouse in 1964? Bill Gates, Doug Engelbart, or Steve Jobs? <coughs> Doug Engelbart. On average, how many replies are there per 12 million spam emails sent? One, 
100 or 1 million. One. What is NASA's internet speed? 50 terabytes per hour, 91 gigabytes per second, or 100 megabytes per second? Ninety-one gigabytes per second. In 1971, the first ever computer virus was developed. What was it called? Trojan, creeper, or worm? Creeper. And let's move to Myths Busted. What mythological shield is believed to represent the ozone layer? Hercules, Svalin, or Pukai? Svalin. Which metal was found in Atlantis and it has a gold-like appearance? Auriculum, origanum, or obsidian? Auricalum, calcum, auricalcum, excuse me. What causes the Milky Sea's effect in the ocean? The myth has been debunked, fish, eggs, and feces, or bioluminescent bacteria? Bioluminescent bacteria. Is it true that microwaving food kills nutrients more than cooking it on the stovetop? Yes, it destroys a lot of nutrients. It depends on the type of food or there is no scientific evidence to support it. There is no scientific evidence to support it. Does sleeping with wet hair cause a cold? Yes, no, not just by going to sleep with wet hair or it depends on the temperature of the room. No, not just by going to sleep with wet hair. Is the five second rule true? Yes, but only at room temperature. It is actually more like the 7.2 second rule or no bacteria can instantly jump onto dropped food. No bacteria can instantly jump onto dropped food. Is applying ice the best treatment for a burn? Yes, applying ice helps to soothe and heal a burn. No, it can actually do more harm than good, or it depends on the severity of the burn. No, it can actually do more harm than good. Does cracking joints lead to arthritis? Yes, cracking joints can lead to arthritis. It can accelerate arthritis due to inflammation, or no, cracking joints is benign. No cracking joints is benign. Does eating garlic keep mosquitoes away? Yes, quite effectively. It depends on the amount consumed or there is no evidence supporting this claim. No, there is no evidence supporting this claim. What is the realm of humans called in Norse mythology? Jotunheim, Midgard, or Niflheim? Midgard. And let's go to Mystery Round. At the Battle of Isandlwana in 1879, who triumphed over the British Army? The Russians? Zulus? or Turks. Zulus. Who received a Nobel Prize in surgery and was the first Swiss national to do so? Alex Carell, Joseph E. Murray, or Emile Theodore Coker? 
Emil Theodore Coker. Which of these was a movie starring Tom Hanks that followed the conflict between the USSR and the Mujahideen in Afghanistan? Charlie Wilson's War, Saving Private Ryan, or This Means War? Charlie Wilson's War. In Buddhism and Hinduism, which of these diagrams has ritual and spiritual significance? Mandala, Mandala, or Mandalay? Mandala. Where are the Comoro Islands located? Mid-Indian Ocean, between mainland Africa and Madagascar, or off the east coast of Australia? Between Midland Africa and Madagascar. What is the number of terms in a binomial expression? Two, 12, or 20? On June 22, 2009, who made a single appearance on Top Gear as the disguised expert driver known as the Stig? Juan Pablo Montoya, Lewis Hamilton, or Michael Schumacher? Michael Schumacher. Which scientist from Switzerland is renowned for his work on the synthesis, consumption, and understanding of the effects of LSD? Albert Hoffman, Emil Theodore Cocker, or Paul Hermann Mueller? Albert Hoffman. Which 1990 British television character was created by Rowan Atkinson? Mr. Bean, Mrs. Plum, or Mr. Potato Head? Mr. Bean. And last one, which sport is Brian Lara associated with? Soccer, cricket, or rugby? Cricket. And bonus question, who was known as Le Petit Caporal or the Little Corporal? Let us know the answer in the comments, along with your quiz class ranking. Tell us how you did, we'd love to hear it. And of course, thank you for watching once again. Uh, click that notification bell, don't forget to subscribe and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.